Good afternoon guys, welcome to my birthday vlog. So this week is my birthday. My birthday is actually tomorrow and we'll start the celebrations from today. So me and Shabazz, we are going out today at a fancy dinner. I think it's a Michelin star restaurant. He didn't give me the name, but I'll try to vlog if I can, if I go there. If not, I'll just take small clips on my phone. Today I woke up super late. We're still getting used to of the time. I'm still getting up in the Ramadan time because yesterday we slept late from the movie night. We went to movie. We came home around 2.30, 3 a.m. So we slept really late, like around 3. So I we couldn't get up. So now I'm going to have to get ready. I didn't put anything on my face. So I just put, I showered, I put the Aveeno moisturizer and anti-itch cream on my face. This vanity is a complete mess. So I'm going to try take all my makeup here and do a birthday glam. Probably not going to vlog it but i'll post a video on instagram and i'm gonna combine this vlog in two parts so tomorrow i'll vlog as well tomorrow we are spending a day in four seasons we'll do a spa spa day for me and she has both of us so that's like a birthday treat as well so that is also part of my birthday gift so tomorrow we'll do that so this video is going to be two days combined in one so now let's make the bed eat some breakfast i'm gonna have papa pita egg and cha and that's it we'll have dinner because we have to leave at five Before I finish making the bed, I'm gonna show you guys my outfit or else I'm gonna forget. I'm still not sure what hijab to wear. I might do a... I think I'm gonna do a nude hijab because I look horrendous in white hijab. So I got this blazer from Zara. This was 89 pounds, I believe, or 99. I'm not sure. This one comes without. So I'm gonna tie the belt so it's less formal. I'm gonna do the Zara high-waisted pants as well in white. And this nude bodysuit. So I'm gonna do this, this, and this for my birthday. And the heels I showed you in my previous vlog, the Zara heels. Should I do the cotton one or, or the silk? Silk is more bougie. I'll do the silk one. I'm literally in between getting ready. Um, I just switched. I thought I would do light makeup, like halka choke, but that did not happen. As you can see, it's like a full-on smoky eye. I'll do my lips and jewelry to aage dakhai feel see I showed. My earrings are from People's. Hate I have bracelet. I got my um, wedding ring and I got a Rolex. So my mom-in-law, Mai gave me one of her uh, Rolex to wear. So that goes with the silver jewelry. I might take the gold one off because it's clashing with the outfit. But this is... The look guys got home and then my and abba got me a cake and did the, the whole balloon so cute guys my woke up at 7 30 she cooked all my favorite stuff and this is my breakfast thal she made for me this is what my made for my lunch my favorite korma kebab that's my lunch good morning besties welcome to day two of my birthday but birthday is actually today yesterday we went to the restaurant had a lovely dinner and it took us literally an hour and a half to go there because of the marathon but anywho today we are going to four seasons Four season hotel so today's plan is to stay there we'll go gym there shabazz missed his gym so he'll do his gym there i'll be by the pool relaxing and just chilling that's all that's all i wanted to do is relax and chill so i'm gonna pack my bag and i'm not gonna take no makeup because i'm actually not gonna do any makeup because i'll be in the pool i woke up to the most beautiful breakfast thal that my mom made for me if I was a thal, that would be it. I'll insert pictures here of the breakfast thal she made for me. And she texted me, oh, are you up? And I woke up early today at 9.30. And she woke up at 7.30 to make the breakfast for me. So that was very kind of her. And she made us korma and 
Elish fish and she made my favorite dish of hers which is kormash so she made that pulao rice and I don't know she made a lot of stuff so I'm gonna have the korma very excited to have the korma so now I'm trying to figure out what to take there so I this is my bag of minis wipes this is from the brand L'Oreal every time I travel I take these so if you add water to this this turns into a micellar cleansing pad but these are dry so it's very easy to travel with so I'm gonna take one of that and do I need a face wash? Now, if I have that, I do not need a face wash. And I have my Dream Coat face wash. I will take the face wash just in case. A mini mascara and my moisturizer. That's it. So these are all the mini stuff I take. This bag I just keep for traveling. Anytime I travel or do mini staycation i take stuff from out from this bag and majority of the products here is basically brand new never used wow i had a cleansing balm as well i think this was my sephora birthday gift set okay i'm not gonna take all of that that's it okay now let me get ready i need to pray so hard and we'll leave guys this is the front of the hotel so pretty interior guys reception oh it's your kind of reception we are going over now guys so excuse the way i look because i couldn't be bothered wearing contacts that's good This is the changing area. I'm gonna change my shoes into heels because I do want to take some pictures. So it kind of helps you can lock your stuff, put everything in. So I'm gonna put everything here: there's towels, robes, and everything. Shibaz is like, so you are actually walking and not so. At the strong smell, fluorine air. I can't properly relax, but Shibaz is proper relaxing here, getting a body massage. And there he had a neck massage. Good morning, besties. It is the next day of my birthday week. Birthday is gone, Eid is gone, Ramadan is gone, everything is gone. Now I can go back to my normal life. I forgot I didn't make an outro for my birthday video, so this is the outro. So let me know how you guys liked all my videos of Ramadan, Eid. I know I should have vlogged more, but I was so overwhelmed but in a good way. I was having so much fun. This was probably my best Eid and birthday. Shibas put a lot of effort in my birthday and my family put a lot of effort in Eid. Everyone was super nice. I had such good time. I was just with my family having fun and I completely forgot that I actually had to vlog. But I hope you guys enjoyed that anyway. Let me know how much you guys got for Eid Eid. I forgot to ask that question on my previous video, so leave a comment down i can finally go back to my regular vlogs let me know what you guys want to see in my future vlogs we will travel this month me and shibaz and we'll do another travel with our family in my pack with me video you'll know where i'm going i still have to do loads of shopping so future vlogs are going to be a bit interesting now i can go back to being myself i'll show you guys what i did some changes in the you guys remember the shoe cabinet i got and that had to be drilled in the wall and the drawers were outside in my bedroom so that got set up yesterday so i'll show you guys that one and our office needs a renovation really badly because there's boxes recycling and clothes for charities like it the, that room is a mess so I'm, today i'm gonna do finish at this outro finish editing this vlog and go back to work do ironing and clean that room up shibas is probably gonna book someone to come and take the trash out but i'll show you guys what i got here so finally this has its own place now i need to get a tray here to put the rest of my perfumes because i have so many in that side so this is a perfect place to keep you where you get your shoes put some perfume on might do a mirror here sometime but this this one fit into this one so perfectly the size you can't even tell it's there 
so it's a good use of space I still need to fill it up with all my shoes so there's that I'm gonna get a tray a tray over here and a mirror and I'm gonna get some flowers there I have to ask my should I do artificial or real flowers I'm not sure so she would have to help me with that a charity clothes that we need to give out there's like more bags downstairs so we'll go outside together and drop it off to charity this is our old bed that needs to be put in the recycling so shibaz is gonna call someone book someone to take these out we got that new chair for the office this one is going recycling those also to the bin so this room will get a new look inshallah by next week i'll end the vlog here and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.